<laughs> good day, good day. How the honk are you? Welcome to Rumorland. This is your friend Dano. And have I got something for you today? Yes, welcome to Roverland. This is the channel that's anything and everything Land Rover. And uh, we're going through this series of um, every model made by a manufacturer. Yeah, just something I dreamt up. And uh, yeah, we're having fun. Uh, talking about that, um, here, Drone and uh, Deschliver, Deschriver. I can't pronounce that because he's from Belgium, Europe. And <laughs> anyway, he was our uh, first um, uh, anniversary winner uh, of our giveaway. And Jerome uh, mentioned that, uh, hey, on the uh, Burga Burgo uh, uh, um, lineup, is uh, they had this here. And check this out. He sent me this. And he says, hey, check your... Uh, cabinet for the um what people send you uh you, you got some burgos in there and uh here it is and uh pretty awesome pretty cool i've forgotten all about this the cabinet sits right here behind me but uh i had forgotten all about it and uh yeah here it is it is awesome so hey thanks for the reminder uh that i had a uh pre-assembled uh with the uh hard plastic wheels that i had to kit and um yeah that was pretty cool um i don't know uh, uh yeah so i think that's what anyway that's a little housekeeping there uh what we have today for you is um something that you're probably uh more familiar with in this size is the micro machines yes let's see if this even says it no it doesn't they're they're so small they can't even say micro machines on them the real thing micro machines the real thing the guy always talked really fast um now this was uh from glue from hasbro the the hasbro company uh from uh the united states now this is a um that would be uh this is a series three so that would be a 110 right no 109 109 pickup with the canvas top and uh yeah it came in various colors some of these colors are uh are harder to find and some are easier to find now this is kind of a mauve color this is not really a red and uh such and so forth and then two they they two also as well as had uh oh sorry different wheels on them too now these ran from like um 1987 to the 90s was the bulk of it well uh and uh yeah so yeah you can get them oh wow but anyway just recently micro machines has cranked back up so uh really kind of cool to see that although i must say um i tried oh we're getting the background here I've tried to look at them and stuff like that. I wouldn't mind picking them up. They were micro machines really didn't do a lot of Land Rovers. Uh, so it was like, hey man, uh, why can't you do a lot of Land Rovers? But they didn't. Uh, I think this is about it. Um, the other thing is we did a one of Wednesday last week or whatever uh, of this bugger that I got. And uh, this is a bigger one. Now this one's got the, uh, what this is, uh, macro machines which was the big brother to the micro machine so they're they are a little bit bigger in size and we'll take a look at that but um so they made this uh, pickup thing there and they made this range rover now uh i didn't show it in in that video because that was a one on wednesday they also made this model as well and uh pretty cool i think that 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 was the only variation of this, uh, the, the rainbow colored, uh, that was the only variation of this. Now I found two of these and I am not sure, please let me know if there are more um, color variations of this one. So this is a, um, they took that one and made it a non-functioning one per se yeah check this out 
watch watch this oh let's flip it upside down so this one let's see what does it say yeah micro see now this one says micro machines in china now check this out it's got this little tab here and you just go like this and wa boom ba boom ba bam look at that there it is a little dude inside the big dude yeah so it was um car carrier i i don't know what they called these uh particular ones that uh just had a simple hinge on the back there i think it's all just plastic yeah and uh they would just pop open and um they would have a little one now i put a, a, a obviously i put a, a defender or you know a series three in this range rover uh, but they had different models that housed you know um the different cars so uh, you know you could get a mustang and they could hold a little mustang or you know whatnot now i don't i don't think i have one in this one no nope. but this one is a uh, really nice but this is cast in that green color and then they added the black and all the other detail pretty good details on it it's pretty pretty cool this one is really nice um and i don't have one in this one but uh yeah so there you go very very kind of cool i really like these uh but they're all plastic i think the only metal is is the uh, axles there but uh really kind of cool how they they utilized this casting you know and and um made it made it two different things so yeah so they they kept well, I don't know. I guess they punched those out. That's why it has these little doodads in there so they can clip on there. But they had a uh, totally different base, which is fine, you know. But this, the, uh, the body casting was um, the same. So that was pretty cool. So there you go. Um, another manufacturer, Hasbro, was the, the, the company... Um, the toy manufacturer, which was, uh, you know, direct competition with uh, Mattel. And uh, Hasbro, I, as, as far as I know, is still around. Now, I have an interesting little side note here. Uh, and I, I really have not been able to find out. Uh, I've got these two little buggers here. And I'm not really sure. Now, these have got little balls on the end. And I, I've done a video on these before and i really haven't gotten any more um information on them i think these are from a different company i'm, I'm not really sure because they're they're a little bit different you know not the same size per se they they are micro machine size which by the way is n scale uh that's uh uh n scale oh those are different too i didn't realize those were so different Wow, I don't know if this is an early one or a late one, but uh, yeah, they, they got different different bases on there. Huh, that's pretty cool. I, I probably should go back and, and watch my original video, which would be totally different from a video that I'm making today. <laughs> yeah, so anyway, um, this one, I don't, I don't know. Um, it doesn't really, I don't know, 2002 PTT or PTI. I'm not really sure, but made in China again. But they had these little balls on it. And I kind of faintly remember um, this series coming out with these balls. And they, and they would they would roll faster. They were more like a racing uh, type. You know, you could they had little tracks. And uh, these little balls would, you know, make them go faster and stuff like that. So I'm not really sure that those are glue or not. But... Uh, what I need you guys to do is is let me know what uh, you think. Look at that wood grain jobby on this little bugger. I mean, that's pretty pretty cool. But anyway, yeah, there you go. All right. Well, anyway, give me a big thumbs up here. Make sure you hit the uh, subscribe and the like button down there. Come on over to Facebook. Again, in focus, come on over to Facebook and uh, show me your glue and your favorite color. These came out in quite a few colors um, and sets. But uh, yeah, there you go. And by the way, 
We hit a milestone, 75,000 views on the Roverland channel. So, hey, congratulations for all you guys watching. That's totally awesome. So keep it up. Keep sharing. Keep uh, viewing and hit and smashing that like button. And uh, tell your friends to subscribe, all right? All right, that's it. Let's, let's look at this, buddy. I like this, buddy. We're going to get out of here on this one. All right, this is your friend Dano saying, slow traffic, keep right. And keep on going and uh, have a great rover day!